This is Alan Bush with the Daily Financial Forecast for Tuesday, May 11th. Starting out with the stock index futures, we have seen pressure over the last couple of days as investors remain concerned about the inflation situation and higher taxes. Some of the selling linked to news that the April National Federation of Independent Business Small Business Optimism Index came in a bit on the weak side, although some recovery with the JOLTS report coming in a bit stronger than expected. Overall, though, it appears that this is not the beginning of any new bear market in stock index futures. In the currency markets, the dollar index falling to a new two and a half month low this morning and gains in the euro currency after the ZOO indicator of economic sentiment in Germany came in quite a bit better than anticipated. Interest rate futures markets, Fed officials yesterday indicating that they did not think the jobs report as weak as it was, was anything to be too concerned with. Uh, we had Charles Evans of the Fed saying that he expects the labor market to continue to expand at a healthy pace. Also, we have some supply today with the Treasury auctioning three-year notes. Over in the gold and silver markets, pressure developing there. But I would not be surprised to see a recovery since we do have the underlying and dominant influence of low interest rates continuing to support gold and silver. So the main trend on the precious metal still appears to be higher. So once again, remember, these are my opinions alone and are not the opinions of ADMIS or ADM.